Hey, what's up? Let's go. You guys like my new hairstyle? <laughs> I look like the dude in Simpsons. Alright, yep. Yeah, I got an update for you guys. Well, not a really update, but I just want to talk about some stuff. Well, first, let me show you guys this pair that spawned. They got a few eggs in there, not a lot. So it looks like they laid their eggs in the middle of the night. So this pair was originally in this one, but I transferred into this one. I don't know why, why I did that. I just got itchy hands, my hands cannot stay still. Uh, you can see the female taking care of the eggs, watching over them. Um, this thing down here with the angels. So, something pretty cool I did was um, I put these potos into this divider. I stuck them into the hose. The hose that were pre-drilled in there. Something pretty cool. Something where um, it could hold the um, potos plants, where the angels can actually spawn on the leaves and won't move. Because if I didn't stick them, the leaves would just be floating all over the tank. And I opened this tank up because these guys are not spawning for me. So I was trying to make a change so it could trigger their spawning and Last night, all their, all their um, breeding tubes were all, all sticking out. So hopefully today or tomorrow they give us some, uh, some spawns. Man, these two are just so gorgeous. Just look at that blue on them. So this pair they are still claiming their side of the tank and these two are still claiming their side of the tank they're not really fighting as much but they show each other what's up not to mess with each other and to mess with each other's side they've been cleaning this leaf right here and also the cone so hopefully Oh, that's one of their spots that they're gonna lay This pair has been cleaning let me see this leaf down here and This leaf So hopefully they give us Eggs there you can see her breeding tubes. I mean her breeding tube Just could focus Doesn't want to focus but yeah, she dropped her tube. And these guys also. Man, they're just so gorgeous, huh? But yeah, that's something pretty cool. Where um, I stuck those, put those plants into those holes on the divider. Makes it look pretty natural. Where all those portals are just sticking out. Let me get lower for you guys. It's just amazing watching these guys taking their own territory. So much character to them. Now I've also moved these two in here. Cause they were up there but they weren't giving me any um, signs of breeding so I moved them in here and last night they were about to spawn but the lights turned off so hopefully they give us a spawn today you see her uh, breeding tube has dropped too in his so if you guys angels are not uh, spawning for you um, you guys could um, 
like uh, make a change to a tank or change them out to a different tank because change always triggers spawning like this down here I added potos at first uh, it didn't work so I um I changed I added a few gallons of aura water which made them kind of um, want to spawn so after I added the RO water they started cleaning the leaves more and after that they didn't give me any spawn so I opened up the tank moved the divider added more potos and they've all dropped their breeding tubes so fingers crossed let's hope they give us smegs So yeah, in conclusion, if your angels don't spawn, change the environment. Oh, I got also got some news for you guys. So, um, I've been following this other YouTuber that uh, breeds angelfish. His name is um, his YouTube name is Amazonian Angel, I think. But I'll I'll try to tag him or something. And um, I I was looking through his um channel and I found that he uh, he buys some angels from this particular person on Facebook. So I went and followed that person, and um, that person she does uh, raffles. And this morning, I just won a raffle, so I will be getting six new angels in this fish room. Six pretty, pretty nice angels. She breeds her own angels, and man, her angels are so nice. If you guys want to check her out, her Facebook is Artistic Angels. She has awesome, nice-looking angels. Alright, so I also wanted to talk about keeping angels in taller aqu aquariums. So, before when I grabbed these two, as you guys saw in my previous videos, their finnage were super short because when I bought when I bought them, they were kept in a was a it was a thirty three long aquarium. So. It was the same dimensions as a 55 gallon, but it's just shorter. And um, their finnage were super short from being in there. And as you guys can see now, their finnage is super long from being in taller aquariums. So before this male angel right here, so her finnage, her, um, was the what was it? fins call I forgot what those fins are called but those these fins right here the little uh what the heck do you call them I forgot brain fart but yeah those were so short they were at where the bin was so like you can see this bin right here they were only up to there and now they have grown about another inch and that's the difference from keeping angels in short aquariums versus tall aquariums. You see this female, her, her, uh, oh yeah, her ventral friends. That's what it's called. <clears throat> so hers has actually grown quite a bit too. And these have grown a little bit when, since when I uh, got them, maybe a week or two ago. And also, these angels, they have grown their uh, ventral fins too. So just imagine if I just kept in like short accordions, like 10 gallons right here, their ventral fins would not even be long. Ventrals plus anal fins, uh, was it dorsal fins? So if you guys keep angels in a small short aquarium, their growth will be stunted and they will be very short. They won't 
have a <clears throat> a great length like how these are. You guys can see this one too. The female, I guess the female is just born like that. But this male, he had very short fins too when I got him, but they've grown pretty nice. This guy is in a 15 gallon tall. So you guys can see these two pair is still very young and very small. But their finish is very nice. I mean not the not really the female because she, I mean, she has a deformity but I mean the other angels look super nice. The finish are super long from being in tall aquariums. So if you guys keep uh, angels in short aquariums, don't expect them to have nice finage. And if you guys keep them in tall aquariums, this will be the result. Nice long finages. Alright, enough blabbering. Alright, see ya.